Hey everyone, welcome back to Otis and Piper. This week's video is gonna be show preparation. So I'll go over all the steps that I do to get ready for a show. So I hope it helps some of you out. Let's get started. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Ears are done. Now we'll look under her chin to see if there's any little loose hairs. And there are, there's some loose ones here. After I'm done with her clipping, feet are all nice and trimmed, I move on to her mane. So her mane's actually a good length right now. I don't want to shorten it any, but if I did, I would either pull it or just cut it. Um, I actually just rather would cut it than pull it. Um, so I would use scissors and then maybe one of those mane combs with a blade in it to make it look a little more natural. Um, Hers is a good length, and if it wasn't staying all over to the one side, I would just put training braids in about a week or two before the show. Um, as you can see, she has two down here because just this part of her mane was not staying over. Um, so I just put two training braids in. But her mane is looking good, otherwise she's got a bridal path up there, and it's about the length I want it to be. So that's looking good. You don't have to do anything there. It is bath time. We are in the wash stall. Got our products here.
This is my show backpack. I take this to every show. It has the essentials in it and I carry around with me during the show. I have some spurs, fly spray, hairspray for me, um, some strap remover for the horse. Hair nets, pins for my number, crop. towels to clean up my boots or slime. And the main pocket here. I have her show boots. There it is. Which I love. There are the front boots. And her ear bonnets. And that's when I'll keep a water bottle in there for me. So this is very useful. I would recommend carrying one of these around with you.